Hi everyone, it's Miss Nikki Ann, and um, I finally have an opportunity to post an update. Because I'm thinking, it's so hard to post um, when the six-year-old is out of school. Mm-hmm. Yeah. Yeah, just hard. <laughs> and I decided since I have so much going on with my health that I wouldn't create like a huge schedule for him this summer. So he's like taking swimming and doing simple things. And which is great because there's not a lot of running around to do for him. But that means he is with me lots, lots to where I'm like, oh, I should do a video update or something. And he's just zooming around in the back. Oh. Mm. Okay, I shouldn't have done that. That made me faint. Mmm. Why'd I do that? And this has been an issue because in my hospital visit, um, I was there because you know, my gastroparesis is giving me such a problem that my um, bowels are just not moving on their own and even with my having done four enemas myself and taking my amatiza it still wasn't working and so I was there for them to get it out so a room full of people trying to get my poop out this has happened before one time I was admitted to the hospital um, for them to get it out and they did three enemas and so but now they know that the I'm the so I'm so that movement everybody just totally set me off. So the salt water enema works best, and so it it took some time though. I was because I can just hold an enema and it not I don't know, and there's no urgency anymore. I don't have an urge to go, and um, they were saying something about my bladder. Um, something on the CAT scan and they like you because they put a catheter in um, in my urethra urethra um, I'm just having problems I mean I didn't think I had to pee but they're like there's a lot of pee in there I was like I just peed you know so um let's see really quick because I just totally uh come on Tomorrow, no, today I have two doctor appointments. Um, I'm going to see a new primary care today. I'm going to see my psychiatrist today and um, discuss. She's going on maternity. I have two doctors going on maternity leave at the same time. Two of my most important, my rheumatologist and my psychiatrist, talk about some things. Um, this, yeah, my last visit with her until but she's only going to be out a month, not long. And then you can still call her. She's taking phone calls and so forth. Um, then on, t I have so many. T Tuesday, I go see the specialist. I don't know, guys. I so lost my train of thought. Wait, but when they they put me on some, t I don't have the thing. I was going to have it. Some at not uh, some other thing for my colon. Screen, screen and syrupy and sweet. It's called lac some I don't know some prescription, and you know it's it, it just passed right by. And I think finally today um, it helped to make a real stool. Like I haven't had a real stool in weeks. Um, I gotta go, guys. I totally. But one thing, um, starting a project. Um, and I've included um, Bal Potts Info, a research, uh, it's a patient's research dysautonomia, and there are going to be some other people who I'll be reaching out to who are on YouTube who I feel have brilliant minds and um, talents that they could um, um, give for this endeavor, where basically, you know, we have all this information each of us like I, I found research on this or I found research on that but just to um, pull it all together and be able to help people with requests like I'm looking for information on A, B or C and we'll already have that 
um, and know where to locate it and hopefully have the actual um, PDF file or something for it. But that's what I'm working on. I've been working all, all the details out in my mind. I finally got started and it's up and so far me and Val, but just to let some of you guys be on the lookout because um, I just need some of your help. I have no, I just could cry. I don't know. I totally don't. I'm off now. I can't even. 